Yo, so how you liking this workout stuff, guys? We brought it back, the vlogs are back, loving it. I love doing it, I love showing y'all what I do. What I didn't show on this video is my movement prep. Movement prep being I did, I did seven way hips, I did, um, I did the lower back dynamic stretches, I did world's greatest stretch, I did inchworms, I did all that stuff pre-workout. What you are gonna see is the movement prep. Because I'm doing heavy deadlifts and back, I did leg extensions, again, super light. Like 20 rep max, 30 rep max weight for 10 reps, two sets of that. Two sets of leg curls for 10 reps. And then we also did some other movement prep. The reason I did pet deck at the beginning is I have a little wonkiness here right in my right pet, it's fine, I can still do 150s for reps, but I still wanna get, get blood flow to it every single time I train. Katie and I did barbell rows last week and we also did deadlifts. We wanted to throw it off. Dumbbell rows are great because you get to have your hands in a neutral position, pull up and really get the squeeze yet still go heavy. Not as heavy as barbell, but heavy nonetheless. Lat pull downs, keeping that form, going to the front, being sure not to make it a row, coming down, squeezing. I went up to the whole stack, there were seven, uh, sets leading up to that. That was my eighth set. I gradually went on. Low rows, four total sets. I only do 120. Not worried about weight there. I bring it down to my abs and I squeeze as hard as I can. No motion, no cheating. I just get it done, man. That's one of my favorite exercises, um, you know, for that, for that intended purpose. And then, I mean, you're never going to survive unless you get a little crazy, all right? So we went on and we did some deadlifts. Now I worked up one, two, three, four, five, six plates. Um, where I did about three to five reps in the workup sets, then I did a max set with maximum posterior chain load with, um, for two reps. So nonetheless, that's the workout. That's what we did. We did some calves at the end because my calves suck and I'm praying to the almighty that they will grow. Hope you guys like this. Enjoy these vlogs. If you like them, let us know. And of course, click on that link in the article. Click on that article link in the description box below. Click on it. Complete movement prep advice right there. This is how I recommend one option to build a big back. I vary my workouts every week because I'm an advanced trainer, but if you're looking for exercise selections and how to do it, one way to get deadlifts and make sure you hit mo a lot of back is to do them at the end because your back's pre-exhausted and when you squeeze at the top, you're absolutely destroying those muscle fibers, making sure you hit every single one of them. Enjoy the rest of the video and that's not a game. Feel like I'm treading water. No one's gonna save me I'm in the middle of the ocean I won't let it take me There's some fucked up things I'm thinking I can't get outside my head Locked out so many goddamn people Rather stay up on